Come on, now the What's up, money? Hey, man. Business is tough. Now, I ain't a cold person. I, I mean, I am cold, but motherfucker. What are you talking about? You want a drink? Uh, man, have a seat, man. All right. Now, I got into this dope gang because it was the only thing that was open to me, man. The only thing, man. Hey, I am not judging. No, listen, now, I paid my dues. Now, I learned in a hard school, man, and I changed stuff. You know me. I do this stuff so I got a chance to do some good in this town. So you say. So I say. So I do. When I get the money, man, I will build parks. I will sponsor kids. I will save lives. But I got to have the money, man. Is all this? All this, it means nothing if you ain't got the heart, Nico. Amen, brother. <laughs> I mean, fuck, man. Fuck! The thing is, you know, Jesus, he did some crazy shit, too. I mean, everyone does. He killed people. He killed that John the Baptist cat. He did what he had to. I don't think you're correct about that. Man, the point is, man, history <laughs> is a long time. And you only got one chance. And Dwayne, man, Dwayne, it's like he thinks it's 1992, and the best that you could hope for is a gold chain and a pager. You know, he looks at me like he wants me dead. Now, I took care of business. I gave him money, but because I won't bow down to him and treat him like he the almighty, motherfucker wants to pop me. Dwayne is a little troubled. He was in prison a long time. Maybe you guys should talk. No, I tried talking. No, I. I tried giving him half of the business. I tried everything a man could reasonably try and still call himself a man. <laughs> so what you gonna do? Kill him? Hey, I didn't say that. Man, you cold. I was joking. But what else is there? I mean, Cash been talking. Now I hear things. Said you and me, it's too tight now. Said you disrespected him. Called him mad. He's going crazy. I mean, he's gone. Prison does that. Well, you can't kill him. Nope. But you can. But I don't want to. Well, neither do I, man. But if he goes insane, we all dead anyway. I mean, Dwayne is a killer. Ah. Uh, I don't like this conversation. Do you think that I do? But it's kill or be killed out there. You got a lunatic after you? Man, you dumb. <coughs> now, I will give you a lot of money. Because see me? Now, I ain't scared of no one. But a motherfucker says he's going to kill me, the motherfucker's going to die. Huh. Man, I'm not sure. I got to think about it. Well, I hope you see some sense. I will be in touch.
You've crossed the line, Dmitri. Not the car! drunk, but not in a good way. I must drink more. I can't believe you said that out loud. If you want to walk out of here, Slav, you're going to have to think about how you will pay your debt. A friend of mine, Dmitry Raskolov, he would pay a lot of money for your cousin. I'll get you the money, just not that way. These cigarettes are not harsh enough. I like a rasp in my throat. I'm with you. <laughs>
Turn around and walk away, or your cousin is dead. I am not afraid of death. When she comes... Ah! Okay, okay. I'm down. Thank you, cousin. You saved my life. We should get out of here. There's a car. Take me home, cousin. There are cycles, cousin. You must lose a little to win a lot. Come on, my cards were not good. Wrong. That man knew Dimitri. He was trying to make me give you up to him. I would never... Of course you would not. Dimitri has taken this too far. He wants you dead. Bohan is not safe. I I I'm going to get us a place in Algonquin. Are you okay? I'm used to taking these beatings, Nico. I almost expect it now. Wherever I go, there are people who want to kill me. Men who will kidnap me. I'll never marry Mallory. I won't be able to sleep with another college girl. There is a knife hanging over me. A clock is ticking. Get the fuck away!
man. This is out of control. I know. What are we going to do? I don't know. We're going to die. I don't want to die, man. Not like this. How would you like to die? Having a threesome on my 100th birthday? I don't fucking know. I'm scared, you cold bastard. What are we going to do? I'm not cold. You're cold. All you care about is revenge and getting your own way. And all you care about is money and gambling it away on the internet. Oh, isn't America great? I get to sit in front of a computer and play Mr. Rich Man and get into debt with crooks. Okay, I messed up. I know I did. I thought things would be different. I, I don't understand this place so good. Oh, man, what are we going to do? Stop sitting in front of the computer gambling our money. Stop uh, getting into illegal card games. Stop spending all our money. Yes. Thank you. And stop thinking about the Russians. Men, we just need to disappear as far as they're concerned. Disappear! Okay, okay. But I want Florian and Darko. I need to know what happened. Give me that. Fine. But leave the Russians alone. I was not the one gambling in their private club. I didn't know! I give a guy a prey! Okay. 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 I'm going to clean up. I have a nasty feeling I had a bit of an accident back there. And Nico. What? Thanks. Jacob? The Rasta? Don't ask unnecessary questions. I want you to take out this guy's chopper. He was last spotted in Varsity Heights. No civilian casualties. Here's my man, Nico. Hey, Jacob.
the chopper. Stick to him, Nico. We need to take him down there with no people. For a man who has asked me to kill a lot of men, this guy is really safety conscious. See, you got that government thing about him. I'll be the great and good and thing. I have the feeling he don't want to be responsible for a helicopter crash in Middle Park. Show that. Yo, this be some crazy shit in a Nico. Yo, we not the star jumping in a helicopter. There's some real spy shit I know he's doing enough. Shows you that the people who need spy shit done get other people to do their dirty work. See him, Bridget, everything crash. Shit, Jacob. You really gotta smoke that thing now? The secondary smoke doesn't exactly help my hand-eye coordination. And I'm paranoid enough with U.S. government on my ass. Whatever. They actually just smoke it. Keep steady for the shot, no? Brother, that's just fucking. I need to be back in the line. Get it on my minute for sure. Come on, Jacob. You need new lenses in those glasses? Hit the thing. Shut with this damn turbulent. You made me lose the shot, you know, man. But I'm gonna know, man, I'll get this bomb back up when you walk out of the place. Pay the fire! Good shot, Jacob! You got some cool shot flying skills in an eco. Can you drop an eye up on the elephant, though? I don't feel so good, you know. Trust me, this thing I'm messing with structure. I'm done with that blood clad suit in a nigga. I don't care what type of prison sentence the boy will attract me with in a star. No more of this. It isn't easy to follow orders when you don't know what the fuck is going on. I have a feeling that it was best to do what we did, though. Yeah, but we're done with this thing in the nigga. We're not going back in a no more blood clad helicopter with that boy there now. No more. Soon, see? We shut down that chopper for you. You think I don't know that? You think I've been sitting around scratching my balls with my head up my ass? I'd be impressed if you had been. I appreciate your assistance, Pelik. You did a good thing today. Now it's my turn. I will try to find the man you're after. I will call when I have something. Hey! Don't you make me come over there! Where can I take you?
Were you followed? Hey, strange seeing you here, Officer McCreary. I told you to come here, fucking maggot. You did? Why? I know about you. Know what? I know enough, boy. Oh, what do you know, boy? I know you killed Mikhail Faustin. I know a group of Russians want you dead. I know you ain't no saint, boy. I don't know what you're talking about, Chief. <laughs> You think this is a town that can keep a secret? I really don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, you do. You know that a man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. That people ain't perfect, that life is a mess. Sure, everybody knows that. So, you look out for me, and I don't look out for you. <laughs> know what I mean? I think so. So there's a guy trying to blackmail me. Who? I don't know. Thinks he's getting paid, though. The guy's smart. He arranged to do the exchange by the Humboldt River off Silicon Street. Said to call him from the viewpoint there. Okay. Listen, I did what I did. <laughs> I made a mistake. That don't make me the devil. Now, obviously, I can't go, because then he gets a picture of me giving him money, and I'm admitting guilt. I ain't guilty of nothing other than being a man. To be honest, I don't really care one way or another. Well, I'm a good man. No doubt. Now call me when you get to the spot. So, we need to go to Union Drive. Okay, here we are, Bucko. Thanks. I'm in the park. Now what? All right. This guy told me to bring the money there and call him. That means he's somewhere close and he's got a phone. I'm gonna text you his number. You know You've you got to call to him and keep a lookout for someone answering a phone. He won't be far. Friend. 
I'm calling about your exchange with McCreary. Yeah? You better have my paper. I ain't fucking around. I'm sure he's got your money. Have you got the stuff he wants? Yeah, I got it. We're gonna make this shit happen. I don't mess around, you know. Push me, and this shit is all over Weasel News. I got them on speed dial. Really? Yeah, and there's a lawyer called Tom Goldberg who's real interested. He's hungry for McGreary's blood and shit. Yeah. Good thing Francis is paying, then. Call me when this exchange is going down. I don't like all the talking. Yeah. Эй, окей, нет проблем. Here, he's dead. Great, I can get rid of these now. I feel like a new man. Not many people get a second chance like this. It's my redemption. Your sins are absolved, I guess.